Hi kids! Today in Bible videos, we're gonna learn about the story of Jacob and his dream. So let's get started. When Jacob found out his brother Esau was planning to kill him in revenge for deceiving him out of his father's blessing, his mother suggested he flee and stay with her brother Laban. Isaac blessed Jacob before he left and told him not to marry a Canaanite woman but find a wife from the daughters of Laban. So Jacob set off on the long journey north to Haran where Laban and his family lived. On his travels, he stopped for the night because the sun had set. Taking a large stone, he put it under his head and lay down to sleep. He had a dream in which he saw a stairway resting on the earth, with its top reaching to heaven, and the angels of God were climbing up and down in it. There above it stood the Lord. The Lord said, I am the Lord, the God of Abraham and Isaac. I will give you and your descendants the land on which you are lying. Your descendants will be like the dust of the earth, and you will spread out in every direction. Everyone on earth will be blessed through you and your offspring. I am with you, and I will watch over you wherever you go, and I will bring you back to this land. I will never leave you nor forsake you until I have done what I have promised. When Jacob woke up, he thought, the Lord is in this place, and I was not aware of it. He was afraid and said, How awesome is this place! This is none other than the house of God. This is the gate of heaven. So early in the morning, Jacob woke up and took the stone he had placed under his head and set it up as a pillar and poured oil on top of it. He called that place Bethel which means house of God. And Jacob made a vow saying, If God will be with me, protect me and provide food to eat and clothes to wear so that I return safely to my father's household, then the Lord will be my God. And Jacob declared, This stone that I have set up as a pillar will be God's house. And of all that you give me, I will give you a tenth. Jacob then set off again on his journey to Haran to stay with his mother's brother, Laban. The End